Since landing on Mars in late 2018, NASA's InSight Mars lander has paved the way for groundbreaking discoveries that will be studied for decades, according to a team of researchers heading the Interplanetary Expedition. But the rover is gradually losing power, forcing scientists to prepare for the sunset of their mission sometime this summer. Using an advanced suite of instruments attached to InSight, short for interior exploration using seismic investigations, geodesy and heat transport, NASA Jet Propulsion Lab leaders have spent the last year on Mars, equivalent to two Earth years, exploring the planet's interior and geological active. By December of this year, however, InSight is expected to have witnessed the last of the more than 1, 300 Mars quakes, the name for earthquakes on Mars, that have been detected during its 1, 200 days on Martian soil. Thankfully, Lori Glaze, director of NASA's Planetary Science Division at NASA headquarters in Washington, explained Tuesday, May 17, the data already collected by scientists allows researchers to accurately measure Mars weather patterns, the composition of its planetary structure and remnants of Th. Just this month, a magnitude 5 Mars quake rocked the InSight rover seismometer, marking the largest quake ever observed on another planet and highlighting the red planet still has much to show the team of observers. Unfortunately, the large quake comes as Mars enters winter, a time when there's more dust in the air and reduced hours of available sunlight, according to researchers, which poses a problem for two 7 feet wide solar panels that are tasked with powering the rover. When InSight first landed on Martian soil the rover had the ability to power a conventional home oven for 100 minutes, InSight Deputy Project Manager Kathy Lizamora Garcia analogized Tuesday. Nowadays, we could probably run that approximately 10 minutes max, the Mora Garcia said. So that'll give you a good understanding of how much energy has decreased. Thanks to a collective of genius minds at JPL, however, team leaders have repeatedly found ways to lift the weight of the Martian world off of the solar panels by using a robotic arm to tilt the device allowing the seismometer to continue making inaugural discoveries.